Hey guys, um, I wanted to show you something new that we're going to be working on. And this is going to be your writer's notebook. So we're going to keep track of all of the things that we're writing in this little notebook. And um, if you look at this on the right side, it has different tabs. And each of those tabs goes to a different type of writing. Um, we are going to be focusing on narrative first. So if I click on narrative, then it goes to my narrative section. If I click back to the cover, then I can click on letter and it'll go to my letter, letter section. I can do that with any of them and it'll go to that section in our notebook. Now, I wanna show you how we're gonna be using this notebook and what your assignment in the notebook is for today. So first thing you're gonna do is to write your name so you're going to double click in there or you might need to draw a text box but you will write your name into um, this name part of it and then you can either go to the next page um, i would probably do it this way so that it's easiest to get to the next page and we are going to start working on a narrative now a narrative um, writing tells a story it can be real or it can be make-believe. It has a beginning, a middle, and an end. Narrative writing has characters. Narrative writing has a setting. And narrative writing has sequential order. So it goes um, in order. After we go there, um, your next page is where you're going to do some of your work. So we are going to be writing about um, something we did over summer. And so on this first page, we're just going to come up with some ideas, some words and phrases that remind you of summer. And um, we're going to use this word bank to maybe help us out in um, our writing a little bit later on. So you're going to click in the text box and you can get rid of where it says type your words here. And you're just going to make some words that remind you of summer. So I'm going to say beach, um, pool, outside, um, strawberries. These are all things that remind me of summer. Um, corn. Um, let's see. Baseball. I could keep going. I'm going to stop here. Um, you guys are going to keep making a list. Think as many as you can. The more that you have on um, your list, the more ideas that you'll have for when it comes time to writing and it'll be easier to write. So first part of your assignment is to come up with some words for the word bank. Next, you are going to go to the next page and you're just going to write a quick little um, response to this part of our writing. So in the summer, I, and then you're going to finish it however you want. Um, you can do anything that you want that has to do with in the summer. So I'm going to click right down here and I'm going to start typing in the summer. I love to read. I um, spend a lot of my summer days reading books outside. Um, I usually get wrapped up in my books and forget to do other important things. Um, I also like to go to the state parks and hike the trails during the summer. Um, I like going to the ones that have rugged trails or have a creek 
so that my dog can run around in the water. Um, I could add some more to this, but this is just a real quick way to start writing and just explain some things that happened for you in the summer. Now, our notebook has more pages in it, and we're going to get to these as we work through um, writing a narrative. But um, for right now, the only thing that I want you to work on is slide number three and slide number four. You are going to just focus on doing those two slides so that um, we have our idea started. And then we'll continue working and getting um, to know parts of a narrative and writing our own personal narrative. After you finish your narrative um, two slides, um, you are going to go back and work on some of your Spelling City activities. I was checking it and I only have one person that actually finished all of the um, activities. And then I had some that finished most of them, but still weren't completely done. And I had a whole bunch that didn't even start them. So you guys need to work on your Spelling City after you finish this and complete all of the activities within the Spelling City.